Today we're going to use the Formic 508DT to show the benefits of using a plug assist on a manual machine. You can see here we've got a, an epoxy resin tool which will demonstrate the process. So normally if we were to form this without a plug assist, the material would get trapped around the top here and then get pulled down into that cavity and at the bottom it would be quite thin. So we're going to try and force the material down into there with the plug assist to get more material at the base there. Now what I'm going to use is just simply a resin tool here that are mounted on a piece of um, 5mm PETG. And then I'm going to locate this over the reducing window return lips around here. And that's going to force the material down into there when I bring the table up. Now this plug assist could be located against the edges of the clamping frame, but the secret is to make sure that your plug assist is directly in the center of the cavity. Because if it's over to one side, you'll get more material pushed over that side and less on this side. So you need the ability to make sure it's right in the center. And even on your plug assist, under here, I've got quite large holes. So I can undo these nuts on here and just push it over a few millimeters in either direction to get it perfectly centered in here. And normally, visually, will be fine but you could just do these little packing strips either side to centre that perfectly. So now we're going to push the heaters back. Here it's nice and hot. Let's put the plug assist onto here, put the vacuum on, bring the table up. We can take the plug assist off and then just wait for the part to cool down. Once we're happy it's cooled down, we can put in some release air and then lower the table and take the part out. Now you can probably see, hopefully you can see that that is a lot thicker on the base there. If I compare it to one I formed earlier without the plug assist, there's a lot more movement there compared to this one. So it's forced that material down into the bottom of the cavity. So it really is quite a useful method with a manual machine to get more material into the bottom of the cavity using a plug assist.